Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. I was uh, being shouted on. Right, we're just gonna make it over to this thing and get a bunch of orbs. Thank you. Right, we're not gonna. We're gonna go this way first. Yeah, the blue eagle will also make you a magnet for precursor orbs. And we'll grab this power cell. Did I get all of them there, actually? I think I did. Okay. Right, that's us explode the lower parts of this area, I believe. As I've already said, I'm probably going to miss out on a couple of... Uh, I love those launchers right there, by the way. Uh, as I've said before, I'm probably going to miss out on a couple of precursor orbs, but we'll get all the power cells. Even if I can't remember where all of them are. Alright. I think we have to stop this machine to get one, if I remember correctly. Interestingly, by the way, this is a tip I picked up that I just always use. Uh, when doing a dive, this is what happens, but if you press X while doing the dive, it'll jump up really high. I've just used that all my life, I don't know why becomes a subconscious, really. Compulsory. Right, now- oh fuck you! Oh well, let's get this uh, scout fly while we're down here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna hate grabbing the scout flies, because they're gonna be, you know, the types that are pretty hard to get. Right, we have to destroy there's an eco beam coming from the temple that's supposed to go to the windmill back in Sandover Village, but these mirrors are stopping it, so we have to destroy the mirrors. Those tower doohickeys scattered all over the jungle must redirect the eco beam. Let's go fiddle with them. Ah, uh, yeah, now I remember. The beam by pointing it at the next tower. There we go. Right, so yeah, you just gotta go to all the towers and redirect them. Um, we can follow the beam to find the next tower. I think we'll come back to that later, actually. Oh god, and I just realized something. I should have used that eco up, up there to open that door there. Never mind, never mind. There are other ways. Come on, come on, come on! There we go. Hee <laughs> hee. Right. We're off to a good start. Oops, nearly fell. Right, this one. Oh, fuck! That wasn't very nice, Dexter. Seriously, yeah, Dexter will uh, do that every time Jack dies, but sometimes he can get pretty damn mean. Oh, there's the other tower thing there, actually. Might as well grab it, then. Uh, there it is. Let's go to the next tower and reconnect the beam there! Not just yet, Dexter. We have things to do. Aw, oh, fuck you. Uh, just check back here, just in case. And there's nothing. Oh well. Yeah, 
Can you feel my wrath, you tree snake thing, out of the jungle book? Oh, we're here again, let's just... You know, may as well, you know what I mean? We still have quite a bit to do though. Pick up all the bits of green eco. Also, one other last thing about the, uh, you know, when you die, Daxter comes and says something humorous. That was actually dropped out in a. Oh, yeah, the blue eco activates this. Okay. That was actually dropped out in a Jack and Daxter 2, but they brought it back in Jack and Daxter 3, which I thought was really good. What do I do? I can't remember what to do. I feel so under pressure. Oh, scout fly. Okay. Yeah, I think there's a power cell up here. Cutting works, I know that. Oh, I love jumping on those things. Oh, moving platforms, no one likes moving platforms. Yay! Yeah, but that's not all, actually. There's still something else down here. Kind of odd that they just give you a power cell there, actually, but whatever. 